and welcome to this week's edition of BS with AJ. This week we're going to be continuing with part three of the Walnut Baby Crib build. We're going to be starting the side rails in this video. Stick around. Alright, now what we're going to do is cut the top and the bottom rails for the sides of the crib. They need to be 58 inches long, but we're going to cut them a little bit longer just to be sure we have enough. After we rip them down to size, we'll cut them all to the exact length we need. Alright, now we're going to go ahead and rip this down into four pieces that are two and an eighth inches wide. Alright, now that we have them all ripped down to the width we need, we lined them up and we squared them up on one end and we're going to go ahead and trim them down to the exact size we need now. That way none of, them, none of them is a little bit shorter or longer. They're all exactly the same length. Alright, now we're going to start ripping these boards down to an inch and a half wide. These are going to be our railings for each side. We're going to cut them down to one and a half inches by 30 inches. We're going to need a total of 30 of them. Alright, to the far right, you can see I've got a block set up. I'm using that so that way I don't have to keep measuring every time I go to cut one of these boards. Since I have to cut 30 of these 30 inches long, it's a lot quicker than having to mark it and then set it up and then mark it and set it up. That way I can just slide the board right up to it, make a cut, and just keep going. It's a lot faster and it'll help a lot. Alright, now we're going to take all the rails that we cut today and go ahead and run them over our 3 16 inch roundover bit to make sure that they don't have any sharp edges on them. what we're going to do, we're going to go over all these edges and look for rough areas like this right here where the saw blade kind of caught it weird. And instead of using a belt sander to sand all this out, we're going to be using a card scraper because it's going to get it done quicker and not as messy. Hope you enjoyed this week's project. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. If you have any good ideas for other projects that you'd like to see, leave me a comment and I'll get to it. Uh, consider supporting us on Patreon so we can do bigger and better projects. <laughs>